that clicked on something hard. Yeah, it That's does. certainly magnetic here. Let's see if we can reef it up. What we got? You buddy? ready, buddy? You want to see something? Check this out. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got on here. What is going on today, you guys? Today I'm gonna to be bringing you yet another brand new spot. I drive past this spot at least once a week here, and it's actually right near a dam. You can see the dam in the background there, you guys. I've never magnet fished a dam before, so this should be pretty interesting here. I have also regular fished here a couple times as well, and it's actually a pretty decent regular fishing spot. What do you say we try our luck with the magnet here, you guys? I'm actually gonna be bringing my son out here for the first time, you guys. This spot is actually enclosed by a pretty large gate, so I'm, I feel comfortable enough with him running around. We're also going to have my girlfriend with me today too, you guys. Hopefully they're good luck charms. Let's get our magnet in the water and see what we can find here today. Do not forget to check out the description, you guys. There's a coupon code there where you can get 10% off your entire order, you guys. And that's going to be including this 360 magnet that I'm using here today. So check this out here, you guys. Look at this dam. This is actually some pretty cool scenery to be magnet fishing here. There's a lot of ducks and stuff like that floating around here. This spot's either gonna be really good or we're not gonna find much at all here. But either way, we're gonna have fun. All right, you guys, I've been throwing this particular magnet here for almost all summer. In my opinion, this is still probably the best one on the market here, you guys. So let's get this thing in the water here today and see how our luck's gonna play out. Ooh, Ooh that's pretty cool, huh, buddy? Yeah. What's your daddy doing, huh? Yeah. What's he, what he got? I don't know. A whole bunch of weeds. Ooh. Caught on a little something. <laughs> oh, some weeds, but we got our first find of the day, you guys. This old beat up lure, man. Holy cow. This one's probably <laughs> not going to be reused again. Looks really old. Oh, yeah, this thing's beat Ugly, up. Actually. Yeah. <laughs> String on there, too. Oh, it's some fishing uh, line. Oh, yeah, uh -huh. look at that. There's a hook on there. Hi, guys. Yeah. Gotta be careful with that, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Babe, if you just okay. Wow. I get that for you. Thank you. Alright, you guys, hey, not bad. Yeah. Let's see if we can get a streak going. Like I said, you're definitely gonna find a lot of fishing stuff over oh, there. Oh I'm sure, I'm sure. I don't know how a dam is gonna like all this the stuff gonna flow down the dam or is That's it what gonna I was stay kind of here? Thinking, like, you Ooh, know, here we go. That clicked on something hard. Yeah, That's did. certainly magnetic here. Let's see if we can reef it up. What we got? You buddy? ready, buddy? You want to see something? Check this out. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got on here. Oh, oh it's coming. Let's, let's, look at all the bubbles. Oh, what is this, buddy? Look at this. What do we got here? It's a stick. It's magnetic. It's not a stick. Oh, it's probably like a wire. Um, honestly, it almost looks like a handle to maybe like an ax or something. Holy cow, this is muddy though, you guys. What do you think? Maybe like yeah, an, like an right. ax handle? But typically that's made out of wood, but not it's metal. It's, it's more like a wire or a tube, you know what I mean? Yeah, maybe. maybe There's like a, a chisel end on there too, or like a stake end. Who really knows here? We are two for two here. We actually have some nice scrap weight here, you guys. Maybe five pounds or so. Let's see what we get this time, buddy. What do you see, buddy? Do you see anything? Huh? You eating your sandwich? Haha! <laughs> 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 Haha! Maybe try. Well, I guess you can keep throwing it at the same area. Maybe try throwing it a different direction. Patience, Bailey. Patience. This is my third throw. There's like a ledge here and then it drops off. Oh. It's kind of weird. I see some fishing line on here, you guys. Yup, more fishing lures. At least just some hooks. I don't really see a lure on there though, you guys. Let's just get this one out of the way here so that no one gets poked with this one either. Sweet boy, Logish. <laughs> you having fun? 
Oh, I forgot to bring your blanket. Oh, I see a lure there, you guys. This one's got a little bit of color on it. I tried it. Ooh, let's get it off of there. Oh man, more fishing line on top of the seaweed here. Get that off of there. Just some more fishing line there, you guys. Ooh, a little wash of rooski on this throw here, you guys. A what? A little wash of rooski. Washer. All that stuff is probably from this thing. Yeah, well, maybe I should try to get more in front of the dam. You would think that stuff would like kind of collect up That's there like before it falls like down. Like it moves, you know? Yeah, right. I just don't know if there's any big metal pipes or anything like that running through those waters there. I'd be in big trouble. Oh, he's throwing his letters in the water, Bailey. Oh, what? There's two letters in the water. No. Oh, look at this one, man. That's super cool. This is a really nice one. This is a super cool one, huh? Is this like uh, fly fishing, right? Isn't that what this style lure is for? Uh, yeah, maybe. I think so. The color on there is really nice. I don't really nice. know what fly fishing looks like, but... Looks like someone made that. Yeah, looks like they, they could made have. It. They could have added that, maybe. It does. I think she's right. It looks like there's a rubber band around there with like this um, like stringy rubber attached to it, you guys. Let's set that one aside so we don't lose it with the rest of them. We're definitely pulling up a lot of different lures here today, you guys. Ooh, what is that hanging out there, you guys? Just a chunk of rebar? Yeah, I think so. Nothing too crazy here either, you guys. Just a piece of rebar to add to our scrap collection for the day. Ooh, there's a black lure here. Dude, the variety of lures that we're finding is absolutely crazy right now, you guys. Unfortunately, that one's missing its hook and its bar, but there's more line on here. Is there anything at the end of here? Check this out, you guys. This is a fisherman's nightmare right here, you guys. No wonder he cut the line and said, forget it. Little pink lure hanging out there, you guys. I'm gonna try to get the seaweed off there. I don't really wanna take that stuff home with me, but I will take this line and that lure. Dude, is that a ring? Holy cow, what the heck? It almost looks like one of those key latch rings. Oh yeah, it is. It's one of these key rings that you slide keys on you guys. Holy cow. I got really excited right there. It might have been like a diamond ring or something, you guys. Look at all those bubbles down there, you guys. It looks like it's boiling. Oh, oh my gosh, dude. There is so, look at this. What am I supposed to do with this here, you guys? Wow, dude. There's an entire ecosystem on my magnet right now, you guys. Ooh, hanging out underneath all the sludge down there, you guys. I have found one of these ones before. I want to say that the fisher called this a daredevil lure, you guys. And I just found myself a pretty good condition one. Almost has all of its paint and almost has all of its hooks. Oh my gosh! Check this out, Bailey. What? I got you some flowers. Really? Yeah, look at. Oh wow. <laughs> look at. Cute. Don't you think they're beautiful? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hold them up. Hold them up. Go like this and smile. <laughs> she throws them on the ground. Is that what you think of me? Oh, I'm sorry. Just toss me on the ground like that. I wonder where they came out as well, probably like the cemetery or something. <laughs> yeah, who knows. Here's another one to scratch off the bucket list, you guys. Some fake metal flowers. <laughs> How cool is that? It's practically impossible to tell if you have anything on here, you guys, because the weeds here are just absolutely insane. Oh my gosh. I feel like it's ruining my chance of finding anything magnetic, you guys. Because as soon as I start pulling it, 
it gets completely covered in weeds here, which ruins the chances of me finding anything. So let's keep moving around the edge of this railing here and see if we can find anything else. There is definitely weeds still over here, but it's nowhere near as bad as over by that gas station shore, you guys. So let's get ourselves backed out on this side here. But I did choose this spot in particular because I knew it was going to be a good spot for Lucas to run around here, you guys. He can certainly get into some trouble, but nowhere near as much as like a regular boat land or something like that you guys so i apologize if we don't have a crazy day of fines but i am definitely happy to introduce you guys to the family but check this one out dude what in the world look at this lure here you guys i think it's broken at the side here but it has that like um i don't know what to call this but it like definitely wags like when you're pulling this lure in that tail is going nuts on there and what that does is it's going to certainly attract fish on there is it's going to reflect all the light and stuff like that off the shiny skin on there this is a pretty cool lure man that paint there almost reminds me of like the chick-fil-a chicken or something i don't know you want to try a couple throws it's pretty hot out today isn't it buddy you got a popsicle Ooh. Ooh. it's so hard to tell if you have anything on here these weeds are just brutal right here thanks yeah, that's oh. that's from the weeds. Yeah, I Got know. A little it's... bottle cap on there, you guys. What is this? Blummers? Have you ever heard of a blummer? Bloomers. Bloomer? Bloomers. That's what you have. Oh, okay. I don't know. It looks familiar. It's something. It does look familiar because it, cause it doesn't beard. to it's me. It's not really like a. It's like an old bottle cap, though. It's got to be old. What do you say? You want to try the gloves on? You want to give it a throw? Sure. All right. I'll try. I'm sorry I don't have a fresh pair of gloves. These are going to feel disgusting going on your clean hands. It's <laughs> not bad. No? All right, here we go, guys. Bailey's first throw on the channel. What do we got? Not very far. All right, not bad, not bad. You know, when you're throwing, like, something that's magnetic and you feel like you do, I'd probably do better <laughs> the second time. We got some beginner's luck. Watch the gate, watch the gate. I don't know there you guys. This looks like a bunch of weeds. A little bit better. Not bad. Yeah, that was good. That's better. I'm definitely a lot shorter than you, so I don't get as much <laughs> air. Yeah. I feel a little weight on it. Do you? More than like, I it's gonna be Maybe tough not. to tell with all these weeds. There is so much vegetation at the bottom of this water. Pulling slower seems to really help out too. If you're mowing the lawn, that's what you're doing down there. Who knows what's growing down there? Right. Oh, oh you you got something. What did you find? <laughs> there you go. It feels weird throwing with my right arm. Oh, like oh, oh. You wanna get down? Watch out for mama though, she's gonna be throwing. Oh, it's touching something. Is it? But it's more, I think it's more like touching something. It's not like oh, something that's down there. Pour up! What you got on there? What you got on there, buddy, huh? I think I can. Maybe it is those rocks down there. Maybe. What you got there? Is it a coin? Oh, look at that, you guys. What the heck is this? Uh, if it was a magnetic coin, it... That makes no sense. It is super rusted over there, you guys. There's not an indication of off. anything But it looks there. like a coin. Were coins ever made out of a magnetic material? I don't know. I don't... I don't think so. It doesn't make sense. It's yeah, I don't. I don't think so. Silver, copper. Yeah, right. Which is all non-magnetic uh, metal. But it is super weird. Nice find, though. I wonder what this actually was. Maybe it's like a fridge magnet oh, or something. We well, got a fishing hook, huh? All right, not bad. Oh, I see something on there. What is that? Is that like a Carmax or something? It's like a um. Oh, it's a, a fishing pencil. No, or, it's yeah, a fishing yeah, reel. Right, a fishing yeah, reel. it I could be a, a pencil oh, sharpener you know I mean. too. <laughs> but one of those things, a little handle. Yeah, whatever. for sure. Like Pretty cool, right man. Not bad. Nice. The fishing gear Never here. Never found one of those, huh? No. Well, I have found a couple of these before. That's yeah. Kind of cool though. We are finding such a variety of fishing gear here today, you guys. Oh, we finally got something cool, you guys. Look at this one, buddy. What do you think this is? What do you think, bud? Is that from the water? 
I think it looks like a sprinkler head, you guys, or something like that. There's some sort of like valving on top of there, you guys, on top of it being threaded into this pipe here. What in the world do you think this actually was here? Definitely sheared or ripped off of something. It was much longer at one point, you guys. Some more decent scrap weight. Ah. Oh, look at this, you guys. Oh, I almost had it. We had a big old stick on there, you guys. But there's also like a glow-in-the-dark lure worm on there, you guys. Look at this rubber piece. You could probably just throw another hook on there, and this thing would be good to go. It's not in too terrible of shape. Doesn't that look like a glow-in-the-dark lure? Yeah, yeah. Usually they're kind of more whiter, but maybe. Yeah, true. You know what I mean? Yeah, it could just be like a... Um, like washed out color yeah all right you guys we are gonna be calling it quits here pretty early it is like uncomfortably muggy here and it wasn't the greatest weather to bring the little boy out here today but not too bad of a day of magnet fishing here you guys we found so many cool lures today and some decent scrap weight but i did think it was going to be really cool to bring the family out here and show them what i'm up to all the time when i'm away from home i'm sure once lucas gets a little bit older here you guys he's going to want to be around daddy all the time when he's magnet fishing here or at least that's the plan you guys but with that all being said i do appreciate each and every one of you for making it to the end of the video here you guys can show more support by subscribing to the channel and i hope to see you guys on the next one